I got a new attack to show you guys that has never failed in war. I got three war attacks. Let's go do them live. And then we'll see if I can still say that by the end of this video. First of all, I'm going to set up this Grand Warden maybe a little bit further over here. There we go. Then we're going to send that BK in. See if we can get him to go where we want him to go. So we're going to take out the structure right here. So hopefully he sticks right inside of there. There we go. He's doing some good stuff. He's actually not getting targeted yet. We're going to let... We're going to go ahead and pop that king ability. Boom. Now we're going to send in the ice golem. We're going to send in the log launcher, the queen, all of the super wizards. The loon. Now we're going to start getting these jumps down. Boom. Right into the core. And once again, just right, right here. We really want to continue having them push towards the town hall. We're going to poison the clan castle. And right about here is where we're going to play the Grand Warden ability and the rage to get this core just annihilated. I want to take out that core super hard. We're actually going to use a freeze right there. Now we're going to start leading in this royal champion towards a single target inferno. Got a couple skellies down there already. We're going to drop another one right here. We'll get a wizard going on the outside to help clean up. Yeah, we got good things happening on this base. Nice. Not too shabby. All right, how's the RC doing? We still got two freezes and we got another skelly spell to play. Going good. Wizard's still alive, working on the cleanup ring. Going good. It's working out really nicely so far. So we're actually just going to directly tank that. We're a little late. That's why we have the free spells. We're going to pop the queen ability. Put that single on ice. Let's get another minion started on cleanup. We still have that royal champion ability in our pocket. Oh yeah, this is, this is going to be wrecked. We don't have that many defenses left, so we're just going to... Pop the Royal Champion ability to take out that last Tesla. And then just drop that minion over there. <laughs> that minion immediately got taken out by a red bomb. Then we don't have anything else to freeze. So we're going to swag that on the clan castle. And ladies and gentlemen, that attack is super OP. It's so easy, man. It's just, I don't know why. But for me, like this type of attack is just easy, easy money every time. Man, start to finish, that just felt so simple, so right. Never once did I have any doubt that I was going to triple this base. We're going to be starting it off with the Warden Walk and a Super Wizard just to kind of help funnel that side. Now, I'm going to delay it a little bit. Uh, I don't need the King working in right away, but this Warden Walk's getting underway pretty quick with the help of the Super Wizard and the Lassie there. So we're going to go ahead and start the King. I'm going to start moving his way in into the base. Here we go. BK is staying back. We might actually get a chance to target that air defense. I think Warden's going to target that air defense next. Yes. As soon as that AD goes down, we're dropping our P.E.K.K.A.s in here. Here we go. We're going to get that in there. We're going to get this. We're going to pop the king. And let's get our first jump down right where we wanted it right there. And our second one down there as well. Let's get a couple loons moving in. Then, how's it looking? It's looking pretty good. Pekka's have a ton of health on them right now. So, we're going to be trying to play this rage right about there. And, Grand Warden ability also. Oh, most of those Pekka's were outside of that Grand Warden ability. No, that's not what I wanted to see right there. All right, Queen's going to be taking out this section just fine. So, we're going to start the RC over here. Yeah, Queen's got Town Hall under wraps. Let's start playing our next Skelly spells. Oh, Queen! Oh, don't die, Queen! Don't die! We're going to pop this RC ability. Boom, we got some early damage in on that thing. And we're doing pretty good here. We're going to get some big time freeze value right here. Boom. Yes. And we're going to start a minion over on this side. 
And last freeze coming in right here. Do we have enough cleanup? Oh man, we got skellies, we got wizards, we got some minions. We got a minion working on the left hand side. RC should pick up where that left side left off. 38 seconds. Do we have enough time to get this base tripled? Oh, it's all down to the time. It's all down to the time. And if I brought enough cleanup, 29 seconds. Ooh, wizard ate a bomb. It was a small bomb though. Wizard is still alive. 23 seconds. Royal champion coming in for help. Guys, it's looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. Grand Warden ability could have been improved. Pekka's were out of it. There was so much going on in there. I couldn't really see where his range was, so I popped it. I lost a lot of Pekka's like that. Otherwise, this one would have been in the bag much easier. Risco just went in live. Looks like he's got an Asian smash cooked up. Coming in with what looks like a Yeti bomb. Here we go. Rage. Boom. He's going for that Eagle Artillery compartment. With that BK in there and that RC, though. Oh, man. They, they bust through those, those Yetis really fast. Oh, I don't know. He probably wanted to get this Grand Warden platform too. Pop that blimp just a little bit late. That blimp death damage could have helped out quite a bit there. Oh, got raged. Oh, he had to pop the Queen ability already. Oh, man. It's not off to a great start. So I hope his plan didn't hinge on that too much. Doesn't look like Queen's going to backtrack to that Grand Warden platform. And she's out of range of it. So this might not be too shabby after all. Looks like he got just enough to get done what he wanted to get done. Now. He has not really cut in this funnel over here. Is he just queen charging? I think he might be. I guess, yeah, I guess a lot of times when people are using the Asian smash, they do quite a bit of a queen charge to start it before joining up the smash troops or just sending the smash troops around. Oh, dude, he's sending the smash troops around to go get the town hall. He's going to be jumping the queen, looks like, through the core. I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh, he's got a joining spell over there, but how are the smash troops going to get in there? Oh, they're ducking in. They're ducking in right here. We got some P.E.K.K.A.s ducking in. Witches and Super Wizards are going to be going around the outside. They're going to be vulnerable to that town hall once it gets triggered there. So they might be in some danger. They're dealing with the clan castle troops just fine. Here we go. Starting to freeze on that town hall. Here we go. He's got the Grand Warden ability on the troops all in the core. That's going to help get through that Royal Champion in the middle there. Give us King in front of his Queen. That is money. If he had a jump, I would say use a freeze to save that king, but he walks out of range of the single. No freaking way. He also stole the healers. No. Oh, I don't even know. If he... Yeah, I guess he, he burned his queen ability early, so he didn't lose the opportunity to use it. Um, Let's see what he's got left, man. He's got a royal champion. He's saving the freeze for her for sure. Like you have to to get through the single right here, right? Um, And he's still got a royal champion ability. Guys, this is looking really good. 41 seconds oh does he have enough time guys i don't know if he has enough time he's got so many troops left they should be able to take down the buildings really fast but are they moving fast enough bk locked on to once again he's gonna use that free spell when's he gonna use that rc ability there it goes that's gonna take down the single there was no skellies to distract Oh my god, one more defense, about five, four, four more buildings remaining, 13 seconds to go, yo, he pulled it off, ladies and gentlemen, that is a triple, nice job, Crisco, so glad I caught that one live. Alright guys, here's the plan for this one, we're gonna do a little short warden walk up here, we're immediately gonna start the king right here, have him start working down this way. We're going to try and cut him off with the wizard so he goes in there to take out this compartment or as much of it as he can. We're going to try and get a wall break right here. We're going to send Pekka's and Super Wizards in here. We're going to jump right here. We're going to have a log launcher coming in from this angle right there, trying to open up as much access and damage as much of that core as possible. And then backside jump is either good. It's going to depend on where the troops are at. If the troops are all towards the core, we'll probably jump them through to the backside. If they're hanging around more in this direction, we'll open up access more for them to the town hall. So depending on that, we're going to be playing the Royal Champion over here to take out the BK. I did bring a couple of headhunters, but I'm going to have to freeze this scatter shot to get that king dealt with. Then we got another single we should be able to take care of, but the freezes and Royal Champion ability we should have left at that point. Or if they go through the core and they come down and start taking out this side, I'll probably just send the Royal Champion over to go take out the town hall with the aid of a couple free spells. And her ability, she should get through that just fine. All right, we got the Grand Warden in. Now we're going to be starting the BK as well. We're also going to be starting this wizard over here to cut him off, make sure that he goes into the base. We haven't given the Warden any healers yet because he still hasn't faced off with that air defense. 
There we go. Now we're going to go ahead and start this and get in that super wall breaker. Oh, all right. We didn't quite get that wizard tower. We wanted to get that first. But you know what? Sometimes it just is what it is. BK popping his ability. There we go. Get a couple of Coco Loons in there. Now these troops. They are tending more towards the core, for sure. We're going to pop that Grand Warden ability. That single taken out. And now we're going to need to rage into this core. Poison the Clan Castle. Yeah, they're definitely staying way more towards the back side of this base. So we're going to go ahead and start the RC over on this side. Here we go. And we're going to start a wizard out here as well. We're going to freeze the town hall because it's damaging everything at this point. And we're going to get a couple skeleton spells going on this guy. We still have a queen ability. We still have a royal champion ability. Let's get those headhunters in there. Help this crew. Like, Queen is not going to be helping out the Royal Champion. Like, I kind of thought she would. There we go. We got a Headhunter in there. RC is down. Now, we're going to clear the way to this single. Boom. Here we go. Let's go ahead and get a freeze on it so she doesn't get distracted by skeleton spells. We have one more freeze spell remaining and a Queen ability. We're going to go ahead and... Freeze this so we can get that scatter shot dealt with. And then I need my queen to pitch in here. Get this archer down. All right, queen's doing her thing. Ladies and gentlemen, we got yet, looks like another triple. Get those minions in there. Hope that clean up. Hope I didn't miss any buildings. Ladies and gentlemen, boom. I didn't even know those troops were going to go, but I had a plan for either way. Honestly, I thought they were going to go the other way. Um, but yeah, that worked out super well. Queen's going to finish it off for us. She's even got the unicorn following her now that the RC's gone. Ah, I love this attack, you guys. It's crazy how easy it is. There you go, guys. Still perfect with this attack strategy. It's incredibly powerful. It's incredibly easy. So practice with it. Use it. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next video.